Hi everyone, today I'm going to introduce the throttle cut function on AT Lines Pro or AT1002 transmitter. The throttle cut function is often used when flying fixed wing aircraft because it is easy to misoperate the transmitter when debugging the aircraft, while the throttle cut function can ensure the safety. In how to set the throttle cut, take AT Lines Pro as an example. Power it on. Long press the button here to enter the basic menu. Throttle cut. Set the mix from inhibit to off or on. And SW here means switch. We need to assign a switch to control throttle cut. And all these switches can be used. And I select switch A, the two position here to control the throttle cut. The position means the position of the switch. Position up here means when you push switch A up, the throttle cut function is activated. And when you push switch A down, the throttle cut function is turned off. The throttle here means the throttle joystick trigger position for throttle cut function. When the throttle joystick is below the trigger position here, the throttle cut takes effect and enters the throttle cut state. Then it defaults to 5%. To better show the function, I set it to 50%. And I need to push the throttle joystick to 50. And now it shows 50% in the bracket. Then long press push button to confirm it. Now it is set to 50%, and the throttle joystick trigger position for the throttle cut is 50%. And to go back to server display, push switch A down. We can say the throttle works well, and there is no throttle cut function. Push switch A up, the throttle cut function is activated. And we can see the throttle can work when the throttle is above. 50%, but once the throttle reaches below 50%, the throttle will not work because the throttle cut takes effect. And now I push the throttle joystick below 50%. And we can see the throttle does not work now because the joystick has just reached below 50% and the throttle is cut. Push switch A down, and the throttle works well now. And you can also set the throttle to 100%. For example, I set throttle to 100%. In this case, the throttle will not work once you push switch A up, no matter in what position the throttle joystick is. Now, go back to save display. And we can say the throttle works well now. And there is no throttle cut function. Push switch A up. The throttle cut is activated no matter in what position the throttle joystick is. And the throttle is cut. Even though it is full throttle now, you can also cut it directly with switch A. And here is rate for throttle cut. It is often used for fuel vehicles like nitro vehicles, gasoline vehicles, because the throttle cut is not connected to the ESC but to the servo that controls damper. So the rate here relates to the servo value that you control the damper. And the rate can be set from minus 30% to plus 30%. For example, I set it to Twenty percent, and the server value will change when the throttle cut takes effect. Go back to server display. Push switch A down, and the throttle works well, and there is no throttle cut function. And push switch A up. The throttle cut is turned on. At the same time, the server value of the channel will be added based on your rate settings. And you can see the server value is not 100% now. The server value has been changed 
to 80% because of the rate I have set. You can adjust the rate according to your needs. Generally, the rate of 10% to 20% works better. So that's all about how to set throttle car function on 80 Lines Pro or 8010 Tier Transmitter.